Artists, storytellers, beatmakers, this is the latest news, deals, and free plugins from the music production world. I've got two brand new free plugins and free updates in this episode, so don't miss them. So did we win? Did we really win? Waves angered their customers earlier this week by removing the ability to buy plugins outright and going subscription only. What made matters worse is that this change also removed the update plan. You know, the plan that allows your plugins to continue working if you update your operating system or DAW. And they only made those updates available to people who signed up to their new subscription plan. Now, remember, Waves sold extensions to their update plan, so this sudden change meant that customers were not even given a notice to update their plugins before the change to subscription happened. Crazy, right? So a few days ago, I contacted Waves myself after reading tons of comments from frustrated customers, and I got a reply saying that they are going to bring back perpetual licenses. It wasn't just my email that made them change, of course, it was our collective voice. Thousands of comments on Instagram, YouTube, and everywhere. So just three days after they went subscription only, they apologized, reversed course, and say now that they are working to bring back perpetual licenses alongside the subscription option. And they did this because of the concern expressed by customers, the frustration they caused, and their lack of consideration of customers' needs and preferences. And since we all love this feature before, they're bringing back Waves update plan, same as before. And there's the problem. Customers have long had issue with having to pay a fee to continue to use their plugins. This is not a typical practice for plugin companies and waves if you're truly listening to concerns expressed by customers, it's time to overhaul that business model as well. I know subscription models are not the most popular among you all, so plugin companies like Slate, Plugin Alliance and Universal Audio seem to understand that customers need options. And I hope the incident with Waves has sounded a loud enough alarm to make sure other companies listen to their users. Waves reversed their actions this week because you all spoke up. And look at what you've accomplished. Now, does this mean that all is forgotten and forgiven? Honestly, this worries me. What are other companies cooking up that's going to hurt us producers? What do you think? Has Waves done enough? How do you feel about the situation now? Comment below and let every plugin company know how you want to be treated. Maybe I'll see them at NAMM and pass on your message. Now, let's get to some fun news, lots of new stuff released this week. First up, Spectrasonics has announced a free update for Keyscape. Did you hear that, Waves? A free update. They've added a brand new felt piano, and this was apparently the number one request for Keyscape. And this is a felt grand piano. They used a special technique to achieve this with a grand piano. They also added new reverb algorithms created just for the felt piano. Take a listen. You can get the new felt piano as a free update for all Keyscape owners. In related Keyscape news, they've added a new velocity setting for the Native Instruments S88 Mark II MIDI controller, the one that I have back there. If you have an S88 Mark II and Keyscape, give this new velocity curve a try and let me know what you think of it. If you watched my blind test of piano plugins video, you probably know why Spectrasonics may have made this change. I don't think our little video was important enough to get Spectrasonics attention, or was it? And if it was, kudos for them for hearing their customers. That's how it's done. Free update. Next up, Native Instruments has released another brand new play instrument. Man, they love their play series. And I do too. Utopia features lush trance sounds that can be used for pop, EDM, and more. Lots of pads, sequences, and basses are included, a total of 151 presets. Utopia is available right now, and I'll add a link below to hear more sound samples. SampleSun has released a brand new plugin aimed at cinematic composers. Sandstorm creates soundscapes, textures, and atmospheres by modulating multiple cinematic instruments at once. You'll hear horns, strings, synths, and more. It's an easy and quick way to add some texture to your music or film score. And it's $39 right now at an intro price. Link is below. 
it's time for Plugin of the Week. Every week, I feature a cool plugin and give you an exclusive discount code for it. This week, you can get one of the most innovative plugins ever. In fact, it won the MIDI Innovation Award at NAMM. Yes, you can get Fluid Pitch this week for $39 using the link below and the code SUNJAY48. This plugin amazingly allows you to set your pitch bend to a particular scale so you no longer have to guess where or how far to pitch bend. You just set your scale and done. And you can set how many notes within that scale you pitch bend to. Pitch bend works as a MIDI effects plugin so you can control any software instrument or even a hardware synth with it. What's really cool too is that you can use Fluid Pitch with MPE plugins like Equator to pitch bend chords. You can download a trial of Fluid Pitch before you buy it, but remember the discount code only works for one week. So if you're ready to buy it, use the link below and the code SUNJAY48 to get it for $39 right now. NAM is just around the corner, two weeks from today, and I'll be there to cover everything. We're gonna check out all the latest gear, test everything, and I'll share it with you on Instagram and YouTube. Don't miss out, especially on Instagram. I'll post tons of updates and demos there, so follow me there. One more free update story to share with you today, but before we get to that, if you're writing songs and producing music at home, you should share them with the world, or at least with your friends. It's easy to get your music out there using DistroKid, the sponsor of today's video. DistroKid lets you upload your music to Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube Music, Pandora, Amazon, pretty much everywhere. And they collect earnings for you when listeners play or purchase your music. And they can help you market your music with tools built right in. A hyper follow page lets you share Share your latest music with your friends on Facebook or anywhere you can share a link. I've created two videos on DistroKid to give you all the details about how it works, and you can watch those videos right here. And if you're ready to sign up, I'll add a link below that'll give you 7% off your first year of DistroKid membership. All right, next news story. Universal Audio has announced immersive audio monitoring support with Apollo interfaces. Well, at least the Apollo X16. With the latest UAD software update, you get Dolby Atmos, Aura 3D, Sony 360, and some other immersive monitoring standards. This free update, wow, I didn't plan this. I just report on the news. This free update includes all new monitor controls, calibration tools, and metering windows in Apollo's console. Yeah, a company just made their hardware better with a free update. Okay, I wanna share a few deals with you today. First up, you can get Machine Micro on sale right now for $199 on Sweetwater and Toman. That's $70 less than on the Native Instrument site right now. Great time to buy it. You'll find similar deals on other Native Instruments hardware as well right now. A bunch of Personas gear has dropped in price in recent weeks and it's still on sale, including their studio monitors, their Revelator audio interface and microphone, and even their control service. Brainworks plugins are on sale right now on Plugin Boutique. And if you buy anything from Plugin Boutique right now, you'll get the Cube mini plugin for free. I've actually featured it on my channel before. Not to be outdone, ADSR is offering Blast Delay for free with any plugin purchase this month. I'll add links to all these deals in the video description and the first comment below. For the month of April, Sunday's birthday month, the Artist Spot is brought to you by Autotune. And what better way to showcase it than on my voice? What do you think? And what do you think about every single week? It's so amazing to hear about artists like the one we're featuring today attribute their music making from deals and tips they got from Sanjay C. Meet yesterday to Dave, AKA Davey. He's a musician and aspiring producer from the Philippines. He wrote this song as a positive coping mechanism to help with his mental health. He wanted to help others by sharing what he created in hopes of inspiring and motivating them to use such positive tools to help with their health. And it definitely works. Music heals. His favorite plugins are Wolf Compressor by Goodertz and Archtype by Neural DSP. And he loves playing his Artria Mini Lab MK2 and his guitar. Follow Davey on Instagram and show some love. To be featured on Sunday C News, create a public post on Instagram featuring at least 60 seconds of your original instrumental music. Follow and tag Sunday C and hashtag Sunday C News 
on your Instagram posts because that's how we find your music. All right, we can't leave without a free plugin, or how about two? Green Oak Software has released two new plugins, Tungsten and Cesium. Tungsten is a very cool looking delay plugin that you can use to create lush delays and echoes. Cesium is a chorus effect plugin that gives you everything from stereo to flanger effects. Both look super cool. You can get both of these freebies using the link below. Last week, we unboxed this crazy mic shield, and of course, it's not in everyone's budget. So I actually tested the best mic shields you can buy right now, including budget options. Watch that right here and keep making the music you love. Bye.